Hey, Bears fans! Welcome to Bears Express, my name is Derek and I update you daily on all the happenings in Chicago. The NFL trade deadline has evolved into a dynamic and exciting event in recent years. With young general managers now at the helm, teams are more willing to make calculated moves to improve their rosters. The Chicago Bears, under the leadership of general manager Ryan Poles, have not shied away from this trend. Last year, they made some bold moves, trading away key players like Roquan Smith and Robert Quinn while acquiring Chase Claypool from the Pittsburgh Steelers. These moves had mixed results, but Poles remains open to exploring deals that can enhance the team's prospects. One common theme around the NFL trade deadline is the acceptance by struggling teams that they might not be playoff bound. For these teams, it makes sense to unload players who may not have a long-term future with the franchise and accumulate valuable draft assets. One such team, according to James Palmer of NFL Network, is the Denver Broncos, who currently sit at a disappointing 1-4. New head coach Sean Payton is eager to hit the reset button and rebuild, but he needs draft picks to do so. As a result, nearly every player on the Broncos roster could be available for trade. On the other hand, the Chicago Bears, who also have a 1-4 record, are not in the best position to be aggressive in the trade market. However, a couple of wins over the next few weeks could change their outlook. Well, Jerry Judy, a former first-round draft pick, has not yet had a breakout season in the NFL. However, he's been a consistent and productive receiver since his rookie year in 2020, accumulating 2,503 yards in 45 games. Judy is renowned for his precision route running, excellent hands, and impressive speed. Nevertheless, his development has been hampered by issues with coaching and inconsistent quarterback play in Denver. A fresh start with a new team could be the catalyst he needs to unlock his full potential. The idea of pairing Jerry Judy with the Chicago Bears' current star receiver, DJ Moore, is undeniably appealing. Moreover, it's essential to consider the impending free agency of Darnell Mooney after the season. Adding Judy to their receiving core could provide the Bears with a formidable duo for years to come, helping to solidify the team's offense. Of course, when discussing potential trades, cost is a significant factor. Jerry Judy is a talented young receiver, and the Chicago Bears won't be the only team interested in his services. This competition could drive up the price for acquiring him. Given Judy's talent and potential, a first-round draft pick seems unlikely to be enough. Therefore, a second-round pick is the more probable asking price. However, this might raise concerns among some Bears fans who remember the team's recent experience trading for Chase Claypool. The Chicago Bears gave up a second-round pick for Claypool, and that move didn't quite pan out as expected. It's understandable that fans might be cautious about parting with another second-round pick, particularly if it's likely to be within the top 10 spots. Yet, the Bears do have an advantage in the form of two first-round picks. If these picks end up being as high as expected, the team could use one of them to facilitate a trade for Jerry Judy. While this approach still carries some risk, it's worth contemplating, especially considering the potential payoff of adding a talented receiver to the roster. In your opinion, should Ryan Poles secure Jerry Judy's services? Or would that be madness? Leave your analysis in the comments. Remember to leave your like and subscribe to the channel. Be another fan of our community and let's strengthen the bears. Until the next video.